Welcome to my YouTube channel. I am Shushmita and today I will discuss about the analysis and design of the staircase based on the stat proprietary software. Here is the layout of the staircase where the riser height is 150 mm and the tread is 250 mm. So the number of steps will be according to the height. First lift is 1.5 meter and the second lift is 1.5 meter. So the total height will be 3 meter. So let's get started. Click on Stat Pro VI type, then click on New Project, tick on Space, specify the file name, then click on Next. So we have to create the staircase or we have to model the staircase with the help of linear grid system. First of all we have to change the spacing, the default spacing is 1 meter. So we have to change the spacing as per the riser and thread. Spacing of X is 0.25 and the Y spacing is 0.15. Click on the cursor. Click here one by one. Then create the steps according to the grid. Up to height 1.5. After that, select all the steps. Go to translation and repeat. In the global direction will be Z. Default step spacing will be 1.2 meter and the number of steps will be 1. Then click on link step, then click on OK. Delete this part. Then select the node. Select this beam. Go to transition and repeat. The default step spacing will be according to the landing space. Again, global direction will be Z. Default step spacing will be 0 0.02 meter minus 0 0.02 meter. Then click on link steps, then click on OK. Here is a gap in between the two staircase. So select this node. Select this beam and again go to transition and repeat. Then the global direction will be Z. The number of steps will be 1.2 meter. The direction will be minus. So select this node. Go to view. Then click on view selected objects only. Then click on edit. Fix the cursor here. Increase the number of grid. After that, create the steps from this node up to 3 meter height. Increase the number of grid. So here is 3 meter. Create the steps up to 3 meter. Select all the steps, click on translation and repeat, global direction will be Z, default step spacing will be minus 1.2 meter, then click on link steps, then click on ok. So here is the layout of the staircase. To create the landing select this beam then change the default step spacing as per the landing space minus 
माइनस वन पॉइंट टू मीटर माइनस वन मीटर देन क्लिक ऑन लिंक स्टेप्स देन क्लिक ऑन ओके that click on this beam to create the landing here the default step spacing will be minus 1 then click on link steps then click on ok so here is the modeling part of the staircase and now we have to create the mesh according to the finite element method so click on the generate surface mesh click on this node anti-clockwise then click on ok before create the plate make sure about the color of the surface which will be green in the top and gray in the bottom surface click on the labels then click on the fill plate solid surface then click on ok after that create the mesh This way you have to create mesh one by one. So click on the whole structure, select all the members and delete all the redundant members. Check the 3D rendering view. Then right click, go to level, then click on structure, tick up the field plate solid surface, then apply ok. After that we have to assign the support, so click on general, then click on support, create, create the fixed support, then select the support, go to front view, then select the node, check the node. Then assign to selected nodes and assign. This way you have to assign the support here. We also have to assign the support in the joint part of the stair and the landing. So select this part, go to view selected members only. Then with the help of node cursor select the node. Select the node from the front view. Check all the node is selected or not. Then click on the assign to selected nodes and assign. Go to view, view selected objects only, then go to front view, then with the help of node cursor, select the joint node, 
select the edge node then go to default view to check the node it selected or not then assign to selected nodes and assign similarly we have to assign the support here before assigning the support we have to check all the selected nodes then we have to assign the support after that we have to assign the section property so click on property then click on thickness specify the thickness which is 0.125 then click on add click on assign to view assign finally click on load and definition before going to load definition check if there is any missing property or not so there is no missing property so click on load and definition click on load case details add the dead load and live load one by one then click on dead load add self weight it will be assigned to view then click on live load click on pressure on full add the load 5 kN and 2.5 kN the 5 kN will be assigned in the staircase and 2.5 kN will be assigned in the landing or the slab in case of accidental load the load of staircase will be double Then add the load combination. After that, click on analysis print all at close. Then click on analyze, run analysis, save. Then wait for the zero error. It shows the zero error. Go to post processing. Then apply the load. Then check the stress of the plate. Here is a stress diagram of the staircase. After that, check the deflection. Here is the animation of the staircase, which is absolutely stable. Which is absolutely stable in all load cases. Check the node displacement summary. For design of the staircase, click on design, then click on concrete. Check the code IS four fifty six. Then add the parameter FC and FY min. Specify the value of FC and FY min as per the requirement. Click on the command add design element. After that, assign all the parameters. Then again, analyze the structure and check the error. So there is no any error. Go to view output, then click on concrete design. Here is the design of the staircase, where it shows the top and bottom reinforcement. You can also calculate the total reinforcement. The total reinforcement will be the number of elements five four three six into one twenty six into two. You have to calculate the total reinforcement as per your own. So, first of all, you have to check the number of elements. The last element number, which is five four three six. 
and it will be multiplied by the top and bottom reinforcement which is 126 so the total reinforcement will be 1 5 foot 3 6 into 126 into 2 square mm so this is how to analyze the staircase and also design of a staircase if you like this video then subscribe my channel and click the bell icon for all the updates thanks for watching this video till the end